what is a permalink actually if you see that wpwebdev.site this is my domain name and after the domain name in the right side everything is uh, permalink okay everything is permalink and the total is called a url if you share this to your friend then he cannot visit as we are in the admin panel he must be logged in but if we go to post and if we see that here is only post published and let's visit the post uh, here and then we will see that our post is visiting hello world and our website that's our domain name and then slash and then a random structure and this is called the permalink of the wordpress but this structure is not the recommended structure as we can um, understand that this structure is like a spamming structure okay in uh, if you share the structure with anyone or in social media he cannot understand what's the content inside the url he may not visit by this structure okay so what should we do we should uh, change this structure uh, we should change the structure to a seo friendly or a user friendly structure uh, uh, if anyone wants to uh, know what's inside the content he should manually um, visit the post and then but if we like the change that is hello dash world and it will uh, send to our friend then he can easily understand that this is a post of hello world or it's related to a hello world content now uh, it's more clickable or it's more user friendly or understandable uh, link structure okay url structure so let's go to wordpress dashboard and from the settings and then permalink okay so if we uh, go to permalink structure then we can see a different permalink structures wordpress is creating for us and this structure is the plain structure by default okay and uh, let's change to month and name and save changes we can uh, let's uh, reload our content and see what's happening okay then our permanent structure is changed okay uh, our permanent structure is changed the past is our um, day and then it's the name of the content okay hello world this name of content but this is also not an ideal structure we can change it to the recommended settings from our permalinks okay the post name is the recommended um, permanent structure let's uh, change the permanent structure and reload the content okay the page is not found because our permanent structure we changed and the permalink structure uh, we are reloading is not in uh, the server so let's visit our content here and then see that our structure is changed and it changes to a user friendly structure hello world and from the where the hello world is coming from the hello world is coming from the heading of the content or the title heading or title uh, of the content let's uh, edit our post and see um, what is our title so our title is hello world if we go to the right side of the panel and settings and then post and then link we can see that the hello world is the permalink structure uh, it is getting it uh, when we create a title the wordpress get the title as your link we can change it manually uh, for every post uh, let's change it uh, right now for this post and save changes and let's visit our content okay let's visit our content and we can see that our permanent structure is changed now if we create a post and see what's happening when we create a new post uh, like uh, we use a 
long heading for that let's copy that and paste it okay what is happening here uh, let's uh, check again if we um, follow the link in the right side a random number this is an id wordpress uh, by default um, creating it so let's paste the our title and then you can see that our link is already changed and wordpress is um, uh, getting it from the title and create a permanent structure we can change it here now okay uh, let's publish our content and visit it yes this is the uh, host we created and the heading we can change it like the previous one from that so uh, one permanent structure is that is a custom structure we can use all of them or anyone um, from there we can, we can write anything there let's create a post name slash something uh, and say changes to see what's happening so let's visit our post so this is the custom post we have created so nothing happened here so let's visit our post once again and from there you go to post and see hello world and then we see that hello world and our uh, custom uh, permalink we changed previously and then right now we select custom structure slash something and this is the permalink but post name is the recommended one for user family structure you should use this recommended structure um, for better user experience subscribe and hit the bell icon